video about newest 13.5 setup. It's pretty cool. I want to show you how I did this. So it takes you three, five minutes to set up your phone like this on iOS 13.5. So this is the setup I've created today for you guys. Just to, if you like it, you, I will post post the description in the YouTube uh, under my video. So this is the, uh, the combination of few tweaks I've installed today, tested them and they work amazingly on 13.5 with Uncover, Uncover Jailbreak. So let's go, uh, go into it. The first tweak you want to install is called Photon. It's the new tweak, it's a pay tweak, but really good, which enables this always on display. So this is always on display in combination with another tweak, which is Zen Xen HTML. So let's go and I'm gonna show you the setup. So the first thing I want to install is Photon for the, for the lock screen. The second thing you want to install is the snowboard. Snowboard is a theming app, theming app for the uh, iOS, which gives you the option to install many different themes. Uh, more, and in my case, I've installed Flux Pro theme, which looks pretty neat on uh, in the whole setup. So it changes your icon as uh, as you can see. The next stop, the next stop is Home Plus Pro. Now this is a new tweak. Uh, which is pretty cool and pretty and works pretty well on the iOS 13.5 and this tweak let me show you where is it home plus so initially this home plus was in beta and you can you can download uh, download it from the repo I'm gonna post uh, in the description and it, that you can see on the screen so this tweak uh, gives you the option to group your icons like this in the middle of the screen or up on the screen or whatever. So how do you uh, enable it? I set it up to enable it like pinch. So this is the look of the Home Plus Pro now. And here you can uh, move up and down. As you can see your icons, wherever you prefer, how you like it, then you can move it left or right. If you don't like it, you can always reset it to the original starting point then you can change the vertical spacing of the icons. See, if you like it like this or more dense or horizontal spacing of the icons. So you have many options to choose from. Then you have this when you can change the number of rows or columns of, of the home screen, which is all cool. I just forgot to mention. So here is the setup for the home screen and below is the setup for your dock. So you have basically the same options to set up uh, for dock and for the whole screen. So these are the elements of uh, customization. So I'm just gonna show you on the home screen. So I was here and here you can even change the size of the uh, icons. So it's pretty cool. When you tap here, you can get additional options. So you can hide the icon labels, the badges if you want. You can always center the icons, which I prefer. You can uh, customize your dock. If you don't have um, iPhone 10 device or above, you can force iPhone 10 dock. Uh, you can customize the folders, etc., etc. So it's pretty cool. The tweak gives you gives you so many so many different options. The next tweak is uh, Xen HTML or Zen or however you read it. So the tweak gives you options to set up your lock screen and your home screen widgets. So on home screen, as you can see, I went to background widgets and I added this widget six, which is for me, it's very, it's very simple and it's free uh, widget and it gives you the time, gives you the uh, weather, gives you the date, and it stays there uh, throughout wherever you uh, scroll back and forth. When you go to the uh, lock screen, so this is the uh, widget, the big widget for the lock screen that I'm gonna show you uh, just a sec. So when you go to the settings, so you have in the lock screen, you will see the foreground widget because I want it to be the main one to be integrated in my lock screen. And this is the big widget. Again, it's a free one. You can add as many widgets as you want. Uh, there are some default widgets, there are some um, different, I don't know, widget seven gives you this type of a look, uh, widget five is this look, 
uh, then I don't know, uh, weather card, you can put weather on your screen. See, you can put it wherever you want, etc., etc. So this is Xen HTML and it gives you tons of options for customizing. And finally, uh, what I presented in the previous video, what gives me the, uh, a special uh, feel to it, when you lock your device, now you have more place on the home screen where you can tap and lock your device just by clicking like this, which is thanks to uh, fast uh, LS uh, tweak. So this is the perfect setup for me today. Tomorrow I might have a different one, but this is really, really cool. Let me know if you have any issues with Photon or if it uh, consumes more of your battery. I've just installed it. And usually these uh, always on tweaks uh, consume more battery. So it's up to you to find the best possible option. So this is Photon always on display in combination with uh, Xen HTML and big widget installed on the lock screen. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did making this video. Have a nice day.